Let's talk about the little things. Um, my gosh, uh, Denzel, Rami Malek, Jared Leto, and a terrific film that, again, people can get on Blu-ray and DVD and digital right now. Um, what, how did you come up with this concept, write it, and, uh, and get all of these terrific actors in your employ for this, um, it, it It took a while. I wrote it in 1992. Um, wow. It, I, yeah, I was just an idea that I had. I was very into cop shows and crime movies and procedurals and things like this. And this was before CSI and, and all these shows that we have on TV now that are about procedural, criminal procedures. Um, but I uh, came, up, came up with the idea and uh, wrote it right after I wrote a movie called The Perfect World that Clint Eastwood directed. This was the next one I wrote after that. Um and I don't, re- it's been so long ago, I don't remember exactly what the impetus was other than I liked, you know, crime movies. Um, so that almost got made three, four times, various directors. And then after I started directing, Mark Johnson, our producer, uh, said, well, you should do it. You should do it. And I had kids that were little, and it's such a dark world to live in. And when you direct a movie, it's a year and a half of your life, you know, minimum. And I, and I thought, ah, I don't really want to live in that dark world when my kids are little, because I'll, I'll, I'll bring that home, and I don't want to do that. And uh, so then my kids were in college, and Mark Johnson said, you're out of excuses. You should do it. And uh, Warner Brothers still owned it. And uh, next thing you know, it was like they said, who do, you want, who do you want to play Joe Deacon? And I said, Denzel Washington, why not, why not shoot for the stars? Right. And uh, he said yes, and then magically... Everybody just said yes. Yeah, <laughs> I got all my first choices. You know, uh, That's amazing. the three the three leads, which was never happens, but I'm um, glad it did. And again, it's available on Blu-ray um, and DVD. So again, these three: Denzel. Again, you could just refer. You know how great somebody is when you just refer to them by by one name: Denzel Washington, Rami Malek, Jared Leto. Again, from your from your your filmography. Um, from Saving Mr. Banks, The Alamo, The Founder. I mean, you have directed Tom Hanks. These three, obviously, Sandra Bullock, Emma Thompson, uh, Billy Bob Thornton, a couple of times, Dennis Quaid, Michael Keaton in The Founder. Is there a through line between these actors, actresses, that that you as a director have noticed that makes them so great? Yeah, I, you know, first, the, the, the easy answer is they're all incredibly talented, but it goes deeper than that. They are uh, committed to excellence. Um, they, when they show up, they know that they're creating something that's going to last for a long, long time. And they want it to be great because they want, because, you know, if it's Denzel, for instance, he's thinking about, some, somebody's going to watch this movie in 10 years, or I'm going to watch this movie in 10 years. And I don't want to look at it and say, no, I, I, that, I, I didn't go full, full speed on that play. You know? Uh, so I just, I don't know. They're just, they're very, they're very particular um, in choosing. I think they also, all these people <clears throat> choose their projects very carefully because they understand what they do, what they do well and where they won't excel. John Lee Hancock, I appreciate the time. Congrats on the little things. I mean, it, it's got to be, had to have been wild for you to direct this film now when it first started in 1992. That had to be rem- remarkably um, satisfying to you to do that. It was, it, was, it was very, it was satisfying, but it was also very strange because you're going back and revisiting your mind from 30 years ago because these are all things I made up. Uh, so it, it was a little, it was a little strange. I'm glad I, I'm glad I got to do it for two reasons. One, just because I'd always enjoyed it and wanted to see it made. And, and two, because I don't have to make it again now. <laughs> I bet. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.